We have the shipwreck up here. I wipe the chat for a minute. All right. All right. All right. All of our emails are in there. <laughs> oh yeah, did you guys get your emails to work? Mm -hmm. Okay. You'll have to look at Wayfinder's Guide. I can't open that one in Dropbox. Yeah, all right. It, hold on. Must be because it's not shared yet. What is it? What is it saying? Oh, uh, hold on. Let me... <laughs> Oh, on, this trap. What a folder. Any changes made will not be saved. Do you wish to continue? Yes. Can open Wayfinder's Guide. Please download an app that can open this file. Oh, well, you know what? what That's uh, because it's not the full file. Let me fix that right now. It didn't, um, it did not. Ah, oh, that's such a good book. Okay. Uh, yeah, it didn't, um, <laughs> log in. I'm going to do right meow. Right meow. I can pull all that shit up now. All right, uh, everybody back while uh, mm -hmm. downloading that. Okay, I mm -hmm. have I yeah. have the uh, map up. You guys are you guys just s escaped death? Literally with seconds left. You're in that room with the chest and found that time core. And now the ship all around you is as if it had never been damaged. <laughs> Including any sort of can of holes that are inside the, the hull. And uh, you notice something else. It feels like it's raining. Peek out the door. Hey, yeah, uh, you still see the funnel and the uh, and the 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 very high uh, maelstrom funnel, but um, it's beginning to destabilize. And make perception. Wait, Say again, David. Perception check on this uh, maelstrom. What's on it? Oh, I'm just telling you, it's wavering. It's beginning to um collapse. Uh, uh, scoop loot up into our bag and get the hell out of here. Running to where we came in. Okay. Uh, you guys are in the. I'm just gonna put you over here. You guys over here. You see Val has opened a portal somehow. Uh -huh. It's the same one that you guys fell in. Almost exactly the same. I, pu you I push someone in it. <laughs> Who you push in? <laughs> I push Mortem in. Mortem gets pushed in. <laughs> Actually, I, I'm not close enough. Don't you have to make it would like have a to be drag check. Or something. Damn. <laughs> he seems fine. Then I jump in after. I just jump in. Same. Cut.
Uh, the uh, door to the east is off. Uh, Um, it's locked with a circle, with a circle shape, uh, symbol above the lock. The door to the south is a triangle shape. We need to rest first. Ah. Yeah. Either way, so... You guys taking a rest? Oh, oh yeah, we have to... Long the... rest. The portal is gone, yes. Oh. Okay, then we can rest in here. <laughs> All right. Um, you see, uh, Val's character kind of grin evilly, and he, uh, has, his hands are glowing green as this green sort of light drips down, and a green wall extends over the doors, and he goes, "You guys are protected." Don't say I never did nothing for you. <laughs> yeah, all right. You taking a long rest, right? This one with me. Yeah, we need a point, but at least you know who he does. I'm wounded too, aren't I? No. Yeah, but you used a lot of spells. Oh, that's true. And we're exhausted. Yeah. Don't after a level, don't you get all your spell slots back anyway? You level? No. No? Okay. Nope. Well, then, yeah, I definitely wanted to rest, yeah, yeah. Alright, long rest went by, and the green wall on each door came down. How we split the loot? Oh yeah, there is loot, huh? Go to your inventory, check it out. I will roll yeah, for Val. I said we grab the loot. I'll roll for Val. So right, go ahead so and take a look at it. Do we want to start? Do we want to start at the top, or we want to make call? a call on stuff? Yeah, that sounds. Just start at the top. Yeah. Okay. Top. All right, I'll top roll. Two, get a coral. Damn it. I was gonna sneak in there. <clears throat> Alright, so. So it's Kashi and Jabroni. Jabroni. Yep. Fine scroll. Mr. Magic user, you wanna look, look at it and see if you can decipher anything? You, uh, you know, it's it's need before greed. Okay, yeah, is that something that I can do as a magic user? <laughs> yes, you can. You can um, uh, you what you're doing is doing an Arcana check. Okay. On any of the scrolls, depending on their level, will tell you the DC of them. So okay. you're in a dice tower. Um. Okay, so. Uh, you did not identify that one. Damn it. Uh, you yeah, next you one. Guys, next one, okay. Arcana. The Lammies. Oh, there's a fine. Oh, I didn't see the second scroll. There's a couple of them. Oh, uh, that's you. That's not me. Yeah, that's me. There you go. You uh, identified that as a scroll of chromatic orb. Ooh. Now, do you know how scrolls work? Not particularly, no. They're extremely powerful. Not only do you not use material components or any components with mm -hmm. them, they're cast in the same round that you use them, and they do not take a spell slot. Oh, nice. They're consumed upon use, but imagine having a bunch of these spells that take like a shit ton of time to cast, and like, yeah, uh, scrolls are really, really nice. Okay. Right, so on next? You go ahead and you're the only one that should be able to cast that. That's an arcane. 
Okay. Well, remember, you can he can cast that without any chance of spell failure. But you guys can all cast spells from any okay. scroll. There's just depending on the there's a DC to to doing it. If I sit out on the opal and the potion, can I just have both scrolls? Uh, God. You don't got no objection for me. I don't use scrolls. <laughs> Does anybody else want them? Hey, I'll still anybody else want scrolls? It's all yours. Nice. You make that, that judgment call for Val, man. Oh, no, that's true. Val, Val wouldn't be interested in any of these, even when they're oh. identified. Is the long sword usable? So everybody gets two lapis. It is an or object, so it is not usable. It's silver plated. Oh, technically, get... technically, it is usable. It would have the same stats as the long sword. So, set and it's hilt. It's a pretty silver. Really pretty. So I say we. Against where? That's true. That is right. So I'll keep it. Okay. How do I do that? Uh, just drop it uh, as long as no one objects. Oh, on the silver plated steel. I'm, pre I'm gonna roll with. Uh, I don't really have a weapon, so I could use a sword. Okay, well, roll for. I'm gonna roll for um Val for that. Okay. I'm pretty sure he'd want it. Seven. This is for the silver plated right. steel long sword. Five. I'm not good shit. in my cat right. quarters. Bowie, you're good. Are you? Okay, so everybody grab two lapis lazuli, and then the top three get one, the extra one. Three of them? Is that what you said? Everybody grabs two of those top jewel, and then we roll the top three get an extra one. Do I get an extra one on that? Is it 18, 19, and 13? I get an extra. I'm still trying to get Kashi. your brownie. Two. Oh shit, get yeah. Your brownie. He's... He's gonna beat me. Damn it. Yeah, yeah so, so 19, 18, and 12? 13. I had a 13. Well, 18 was supposed to be more of them. I don't know why it didn't. If you need a weapon. I got, I got a stick. Some extras. I got a staff. Well, he's also a uh, spellcaster. He is yeah. definitely not unarmed. Yeah. Granted, Fuck, you need not... a backup. Uh, David, you grab one, and Jenny grab an extra one. And we roll for the. Uh... Grab an extra. Wait, I rolled the 13 on that. Shouldn't I get the extra one too? 18, 19, and 13? Oh, I didn't see your 13. My bad. Yeah. Right. My fucking lap is lazuli. <laughs> oh, I see that. I just think one Minecraft. Left, so... All right, I, I, I got my extra one. Yeah, no shit, right? Oh, it's David. Yep. Hold on. Opal, what is that? October? Didn't see the 13 either. It's a very, very nice gem. Thousand gold piece. Woo! David. What's up? Grab your other gem. Your lapis 
the Zuli. And then I grab one. Do I need to grab one more still? Oh no, I'll oh, get. Oh, okay. Val, oh. sorry. No, Val, I forgot. Who didn't grab two? Val, Val didn't. Oh, okay. Okay. Alright, roll for the opal. I'm sitting out on that because I took the scrolls. Boom on the match! I'm not rolling. Are you, you going to roll on the opal, Jeff? Oh, you did. Never mind. I did, yeah. Didn't. Uh, Jenny. And... I'm not rolling. Yeah, I'm not rolling on mine either. Koa. I'm not rolling on nope. it. Nope. It's all yours, Brian. Oh. Yep. I said I wouldn't if I got the scrolls. I'm a man of my word. Oh, okay. Hello. Uh, we don't know what... Yeah, we don't know what that is. Potion is... But, okay. And we don't have an identifier, so... <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do we want to roll on it, or...? Uh, sure, I'll roll on it. Oh, wait, did I say I wasn't going to roll on the potion, too? I might have. You can, you're fi you can roll on it, man. It's right, a potion. The, the the scroll it's it's need before greed, man. <laughs> <laughs> you needed the scrolls. I'm not used to playing with people like that. I'm used to playing with Mike. Mike was like, "It's all mine. <laughs> it's all fucking mine. You're gonna be my slaves." Prostitutes. <laughs> oh, I know. Always. Yeah, prostitutes. I don't want the potion. <laughs> I don't. Ha well, actually, would I be able to d identify it with my al alchemy? With alchemy. <laughs> Yeah. Mm, no, I'm an alchemist. Negative. It'd be a magical potion. You would need magical means to identify it. Okay. I was just asking. Yeah. God, geez, no, but um, head off, man. <laughs> but uh, there are alchemist testing kits you can get at a higher rate that would do that. Like yeah. uh, kind of like like yeah, a, I don't want a dropper. Potion. So. It's a dropper of dispel magic. Nobody wants it. Yeah, I'll take uh, it if nobody wants it. What's, nah. what, what's that? The potion, the unidentified potion. The unidentified uh, potion. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, I'm sure Does Val that want? Val's going to roll for it. All right, I'll roll. I rolled a 13. Okay. Cheers. Boom. Well, you get it, it. It's a fun potion. I'll find someone to to tell me what it is. Go always just drink it. I'm not gonna just willy nilly drink some random <laughs> potion. A, a liquid with the eyeball floating in it. You're like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna taste this delicacy. No, that's what happened the first time I took GHB. I was like, fuck uh, out. Uh, my stuff ain't showing. Potion, so I don't need a potion of healing. Why is this not going? This is right, so Val's gonna so take one. So... Potion is. I say, Bowie takes one. Val. God, I can make more, so I'm not worried about pushing the heat. Bro, I can, I'll take some if they're yeah. just handing them out. Shit. There's five of them. I'll take one. Yeah, take one. Take one. Everybody right. take one except for Mortem, because I, I got four three. now. I got four, so... Okay. So there's one uh, more that needs to uh, go out. Which uh, is... Do we want to roll on the time core, or what? do we just want to, um, like, Captain's Quarters? It's not showing in my in... Yeah, what to do with it. Inventory. Uh, don't, I might die. Well, I shouldn't be curious. Look at its weight, so keep that in mind. Oh, 25. Yeah, I'm good. Alright, you carry it, I don't care. Put it in Nothing the Nothing's showing up. In my inventory. In the time co for what? Ooh. Everything. No. Oh, really? Never mind. I'm looking here, hold on. Your character sheet looks a little bit whacked, bugged. Hold on, I'm gonna clean it. It shows my usual stuff, but not right. the. I moved your healing potion over. It's... Oh, that's right. You have a quadruple. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> that you hatched yourself. I thought it hatched already. It did. 
Yeah, I did. It's in the room. On the ship. But it's not... The long sword. And the gems. The Lubzuis. The gems? Oh, wait a second. Yeah, what's going on here? Are you dragging it and dropping it on your inventory page? Yes. <laughs> That's cool. Okay. So, you had... An opal, right? No. no. I, I opal. Okay, let me see what's going on here. Two lapis lazuli and the sword. And okay. the potion of healing. Alright, hold on. Yeah, it's not showing up. Like, for us, for everybody else, it says, you know, party, twang, and then the item. For Jenny, it's, you know, party, her, and then nothing. Like, in the, uh, the chat window. Every time she grabs something, it's blank. Oh, yeah. All right. Okay, let me see here. Um, I think that's the sword. Tables. Okay, are you grabbing it by the link or by the words? I think I grabbed it by the link. Okay. You gotta grab it, uh, grab it by the uh, shield. Let me just, I want to make sure that you don't have a bug on your character. Hold on one second. Uh, let me bring up. That was a that was a silver plated. Uh, it was worth seven hundred and fifty gold, right? I I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Good. Our That's object good. worth seven fifty. Yep, there it is. Okay, so silver. There it is. There we go. Um, try. Jenny, try dropping that on your character sheet with uh, grabbing the shield. And you had also, a, what, two Lapis Azules? Yes. What are those worth? 50? No. Hold on. What's up? They're 10. Hey, you want okay. me to just drag one no, back no, no. and then you you can change the number? No, I got it. I found it. And she had, what, uh, what else did she have? Did, uh, did she win? The potion of healing? I dropped that on her character sheet. That should okay. be everything. Alright, Jenny, okay. go ahead and yeah, try moving. should be everything. Try moving those. Not doing it. And... Do you have your character sheet open? Yes. What does it say? Uh, says nothing. I grab it by the number. Okay. Grab the shield. Grab the shield. The little dot. Yeah, the little dot, the shield dot. Yep, that's uh, any anything that has that shield icon is an, as a draggable object. I like to think of it as a super dark nipple with milk coming out of it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, that, now it's working. Oh. <laughs> Okay, perfect. Now, um, we'll go over your sword stats in a little bit. If you're gonna, you're gonna keep that sword as a regular sword, right? Yes. It's effective against swear creatures. <laughs> All 
Who's carrying this right. heavy ass time core? Someone else ought to carry the time core, because that'll put me like right at my maximum. Uh, what am I at? Hold on, let me look. I can carry it. And cool. Bowie's interested in. Well, I can carry it too. It yeah, won't. Well, it'll put me like damn near at max, so yeah, I don't. No, uh, it'll it, it put me about under half, so I, I can carry it if nobody wants. Well, we definitely ain't selling. I can carry it too. Right, investigate. So we can roll. Well, fuck it. Someone just grab it then. I think this is a group item. Relevance. All right. Figure it out. We're, that, we're, like, we're, gonna, we're gonna talk to somebody about both the scroll and the potion and yeah. the time thing. Time cores, and we all need to work on those uh, portals. Yeah, I know. We figure out how to put those together. We need to talk to somebody. We're in this dungeon. We find ourselves a magi who wants to join our group. Maybe the people over at our island would know. The ghost people. Whatever. The ghost. Yeah. Or maybe our demon would know. Does that sword have a circular uh, butt on it? Maybe we use it as a. I'm pretty sure right. we've got to find another piece of this key, and I have hey, your, can you uh, distribute the coins, Jeff? Yes, the um, your sword is on there now, Jenny, uh, and it's it's uh, got the appropriate stats. finished you guys okay so yeah you're arrested you're in that room oh that is cool did you guys do you guys um i think they updated it uh look at your graphics window where you see the x and the question mark do you see an arrow Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Click that. It it spreads it along the table. Yep. Oh, nice. That yeah, is nice. Oh, so we can all share a map now? No, I just like underneath the table, underneath your pages, if you got a bunch of them up. Like I got my. I don't. They didn't do nothing for me. Really? I'm getting, I'm getting an error. Uh. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I'm getting picking up. Picking up bad, Brian. Yeah. Error when I click it, so. Yeah. I still like it up there. Script error. It must be because of my enhanced images. All right. All right. I'm actually good on that now. We shouldn't need it. Okay. So, all right. So the, the green walls came down. You have the door to the south is a is a, tri a triangle key, and to the west is a circle key. You guys have a triangle and a star shape. Well, Bowie it has the key. So it's star shaped. Oh. Uh, so. Go somewhere so. else. Then. She opens door. All right. Oh my God, mask mode. Where is it? Alright, yeah, it looks like, hold on, 
Um. The order. Are you doing that? Well, uh, Bowie's up front. The low area. That better spot. <laughs> We still in the uh I don't see the tokens. Tokens? You have the map underneath your Are you in the Aquarian Sanctuary? We're back in the uh, uh, the puzzle rooms and shit. That's what the I map is too, the uh, Aquarian know. Sanctuary. Do you have the, yeah. the outward tab? There they are again. You gotta must uh, it was it was like the same map, but it wasn't. See, it happened again. Hold when on. I when I uh, you know what it I, is. You I'm having on. trouble moving. It's okay. Yeah, I know why. Um, okay. Uh, back out real quick. No, I have it now. Yeah, no, I, I know, but uh, I have a an extension that's fucking everything up, and I gotta turn it off. So I'll back out for one minute, and I'll turn it off, and we'll come right back in. Cause it fucked up by my scaling too, and I, I guess it didn't update. All of us? Just real quick. Alright, I'm gonna grab something to drink. Yep, yeah, okay. I am sorry we got like nowhere, guys. I have, I really apologize for a shitty game today. Oh. Alright, loading. Okay, right. Alright, we're good. Gonna have to edit that part out.
All right, that's everybody. Okay, try. Oh, uh, see if that arrow thing works for you now. I'm still trying to load everything. Yeah, that's fine. There it goes. No, I'll still get a script error. Okay. Um, um next gaming session it's we'll okay. have you clear yeah, we'll clear your uh, clear cache. We'll deal with Okay. Uh, yeah, that's a pretty awesome feature. It turns your the table into a like a like a background map, so you can move everything on it and not actually get in the way. It's fucking awesome. Okay, all right, the uh, buoy. You that door is unlocked. I, I slowly peeked in. Shall I roll stealth? You may roll stealth, yes. Oh. Okay. Let yeah, me shit have those pillars. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. They are actually glowing, so there is light in here. Um, what you see in this room are... Uh, you see three doors. To the south, you see a door with a handprint. A, a hand... An imprint where a hand can go. A five-fingered hand can go. Right? Medium-sized person. To the north... Is a, is a, uh, a simple door. Uh, and then to the east is a door with um, a uh, a circle key. And in the center of this are these two atrocious looking uh, females. And surrounded are a swarm of snakes. They do not yet see you. They're alive, right? <sighs> well. I slowly back up. <laughs> okay. And I whisper. On the room condition. So she lets you guys know that this room is packed full of goodies. I throw sleep on him. You may try. What do you guys think? I'm in the back of this group. Yeah, but you can squeeze by. Alright. What do you guys want to do here? There's a big swarm of fucking... Two. Use the corridor to funnel them. Well, that's not a bad idea. <clears throat> you the tank. Should we... Does anybody have some oil? They can't see shit. What? Oil. 
But then you guys would be screwed too because you can't see. Yeah. Can't cast it past us in the middle of the room? Yes, you may. Yeah, you just have to get up front. Is that what you're doing? You're going to go to the front of the door? I was thinking. Do you stand there? Just throw oil in the room. And then let him come to me. Let me try and, and light sleep. It on fire. Yeah. So does any body have oil? Oil? Yeah, like Alchemist Fire. Oh, I have a tinder box. <laughs> I'm checking Val right now. He does I'm sorry. not. What are we doing? Do you have to throw you guys oil. Have oil. Any Let's sort of throw oil. oil and light it on fire. I have. We have lit torches, guys. Me and Val both have lit torches. Yeah, no, but well, I mean the oil being the... that it would they're snakes and they slither on the ground. I mean, that's the kind of the perfect way to burn them out. I have alchemist fire that we can light it with a torch. Alright, right. alchemist fire in the middle of the room and watch it spread. And... Well, it's it's alchemist fire. We have to sit here and wait for it to impact. burn out. Yep. Well, yeah. That won't do. Uh. Does Jabroni have any spells? Not inside. You are inside, so you're sort of a neutered druid. H handy crippled. Yeah. Hmm. I. He's got magic stone, thorn whip, foundation of stone, spike growth. Wait, Ooh. that's a level two spell? Spike growth? Yeah, a level two spell. Yeah, that's right. I thought that was a cantrip. Which is freaking. No. Are we Mike? going up the stairs or down the stairs? That is going downstairs. Okay, cool. Long range would be in back. And they can chew over me. With... A spike growth wouldn't work in here. Why not? Because that'd be outside. Burn them, spike them, sleep them, shit, we'll do it all. What's your range? Run them into the spike road. Right? Trying to oh, escape. 150 feet. And a 20 foot radius, so yeah, that would cover that whole room. Because <laughs> my 15 foot darkness would cover, like, all the way back to Bowie. Yeah. Would I be able to see in the darkness? I don't, I... Well, the, 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 the place is lit up because of the uh, pillars. Yeah, magic. Does your darkness work against magic light? It is magical. It's magical darkness, no. so it snuffs out all, all darkness. Now, the, a light, it will cancel out light spells. Much like if you were to cast a light spell into darkness, it would cancel it out. So it's... Mm. How far, or big, sorry, is the alchemist fire? Oh, yeah, but if I cast darkness in there, you guys are all screwed. I'm the only person that can see through magical darkness. Yeah, don't throw darkness. Throw the Well, you spikes. need to be careful with darkness because it being a magical spell, 
it would radiate magic altogether and also effectively blind Ardris. Oh, that's right. Huh? Darkness itself is all of it is magical. So when you cast darkness, it would also blind Ardris because all they would see is darkness, or all they would see was magic. So it it effect it effectively blinds Ardris as well. Oh, that's dark. Darkness is impenetrable. Oh, even that was by a waste elves. of a spell. Even by even by um. Even by um, what do you call it? Uh, uh it, it, it's effective against all things, including dragons. They, the only thing that they can see through it is the tremor sense, but it blocks out all light, even including infravision. You wouldn't be able to use any sort of sight. It's complete blindness. Well, well, no, the uh, devil sight, the invocation. Yeah, not invocation. Uh, yeah, invocation. Sorry. It sees through all. You see normally in darkness, both magical and non-magical, right. to a distance right. of 120 so then, feet. Then you would that you specifically would be able to penetrate that darkness. But that, that that I would be able why to. I did it because right. I could right, but let's say less of that go, you know uh, if we need to move through a, a, a treacherous terrain or something. I can cast right. it on me. And you just guide everybody. You can guide us through, you know, tie a rope right. between us and right. guide us through. Uh, that's a good way to use it. I I've got lots of ideas for this spell. Or, you know, <laughs> or, well, no, I don't want to ruin the spoiler on because you're going to be pissed when I uh, do it. All right, anyways, what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we, are we rolling initiative or what so we can figure out what we're doing? Jenny wants to know how big the alchemist fire is, and it is only 10 feet. Ten foot explosion. Hmm. Yeah, which will cover that whole. Gotta get rid of the monsters first. It will cover their whole room. Center it on. So, like Brian said, pretty much, pretty much the whole room. Ish. Uh. It doesn't tell me. Uh. Oh. <laughs> uh, uh, ten we foot. The surprise. As an action, oh, throw this flag up to 20 feet, shattering it on pin pack, may range attack against a creature or object, treating the alchemist fire as an improvised weapon. On hit, the target takes 1d4 fire damage at the start of each of its turns. Yep. A creature can end this damage by using its action to make a DC 10 dexterity check to extinguish the flames. Right. So, never mind, there is no impact, no explosion. You want me to try and sleep some of these before we attack? It's a good. You could do that. Let me sleep them. What is it? How big is sleep? All right. Yeah, so you do sleep. Sleep that, is more. This is a good point to use your uh, meta magic, your sorcery points. Wait, I can use sorcery points for sleep? Mm. Yep. Oh, wait. You, want. you can use sorcery wait, points for any of your sorcery magic. Your every spell. Look at your meta magic spells. Any any non non warlock spell you can use okay sorcery points you know what no i'm just gonna go ahead you can use sorcery points on all of your spells because they're all jumbled up anyway so let's just yeah keep it simple. Makes, i'm like that's I can't fine tell. that's I, fine uh, you can use sorcery points on all of your spells um so if you look at your character's metamagical ability so if you go to your ability tab yeah, and you look at meta magic. Yep, look at some of those because you could. I'm not going to give it away because you're too advanced of a player for that. It's third level though. I got a while before I get that, right? No, meta magic. Uh, no, you're. At you're third, third level, level, you gain. No, not for a warlock. I'm a third no, level. No, but you're you're third level sorcerer. sorcerer. You can yeah, use okay. that. Yeah, so you can use the anything that's on your character's abilities is assumed that you can use because they shouldn't populate unless you've actually reached the level to get it. Uh, well, so, I did. I did populate it with a bunch of shit. That's why right. I was asking you before. Make sure. Yeah, that no, this is legit. I, I got you. I already quality checked your character. Uh, all right, good. So good. no, but looking at your character, you have a level three sorcerer, so you can use the meta magic on anything that says level three, which is all of them. So you can use these to. Maximize your spell's ability. So I can throw this at a level two, or yeah, two. 
that you can do that. What he's saying is you can maximize it so then it it rolls the maximum hit dice that it can do. Well, in this automatically, case, you don't even have oh. to roll. Well, what, well, in this case, you could use um, it's there's no they took away maximize spell, but you oh. could use something like twin spell. Twin spell. Yeah, re, re, the very. Um, um, that's the very bottom. Okay. Um, uh huh. Took out. Oh, that's, that's not it. Yeah, that's they did, terrible. but they did not take away um. Heightened spell, extended spell, um, empowered yeah, spell would be one. Empowered, em empowered w would be good for you. See, so you get to roll damage in this case. Troll would be, damage, though. It wouldn't be considered damage. You'd be using. Uh, it'd be considered the hit points that you would use. Where are these sorcery points on my page? Because it's ah, uh, good. Okay, so under actions. Okay. Um, actions. I'm actually going to make, um. An ability for you right now because I'm like I'm not seeing any sorcery points you should have two oh, pack, I have pack magic first level two pack magic is your warlock yeah well I don't see it I mean I have four first level now you should have three okay, sorcery so points Okay, new spell or ability, I see it. Well, whatever we do... Rushing towards us, or... You have... Let's see, how many sorcery points do you get? You get... You gain two... Oh, you have to pick. Um, I, for now, I'm gonna let you have access to all of them. Okay. Uh, but, um... Uh, sometime this week, okay? Or, okay. or by the end of the night, pick, pick, uh... Pick two. Pick two of these that you would use as, a. Uh, Typically, okay. um, I'll give you, yeah, you're going to want to, I'm just going to go ahead and write this down as magic magic. You get, um, I'm going to look at your, it spell wouldn't work for sleep. Which one? It's only, it's a, the twinned spell? No, no, it wouldn't. I was yeah, thinking would either uh, not height, uh, but like shot grasp wood. No saving through on that. Uh, no, empowered spell would work. Because I'm rolling, what, d8s? Yeah. For damage, for the sleep? Duh, yes, d8, yeah. So. Basically, the empowered would let you re-roll low and dice. And because my charisma modifier is high. Oh yeah, and you add your charisma modifier to the roll. Yeah, that that'd be the perfect way to that, do it. So there you go. Oh, you can re-roll low dice. Yep. You can spend up to your charisma modifier. Uh, you can spend an action point, a uh, sorcery point, to re-roll a number of damage dice equal to up your, to your charisma modifier. Right. And you and you have to use the new rolls. Right. So yeah. you can you, like you can roll you can roll up to three. Oh, I'm gonna be adding some like maximize spell, but um you can add um you can re-roll three of the low dice that you roll for one source. Nice. Of okay. So um hold on, let me see here. I am going to add. You get you actually have three total sorcery points. Okay, three total. And you'll you see use one source point to re-roll up to five dice. That, well, at least that, that's how it reads to me. Yeah, that's, that's my charisma modifier. That's how it is. You can five, spend yeah. one sorcery point to for up to your charisma modifier. That's my right. charisma modifier is seven. So you could re-roll uh, pretty much all your dice then. Yeah, that's that's a great way. Yeah, uh, empower the sleep. Okay, so you want imp you want empower spell as one of your meta magics, right? Yeah, for sure. 
Okay. Then the other one. Uh, extend spell for like my decent. Does that maximum up to 24 hours? And that sounds. Distant spells another good one. No, they're all good and situational. Right, but quicken, you, really situational. quicken sounds good too because you could turn a regular spell into a bonus action. That's right. That is a really oh. powerful spell. I think I want quick. Especially since I lifted the um, restriction on how bonus ma bonus spell work. Normally, in raw rules, you cannot cast a any bonus action spell above cantrip if you already use or I'm sorry if you cast a bonus action spell you cannot cast another spell unless it's a cantrip spell it's confusing but basically the way I roll it it, it basically don't want you to turn into a fireball on um, right. like a fireball machine gun uh -huh. but in my games if you can think it i probably let you do it. Man, quick and spell sounds pretty amazing. It, it is a good one. Yeah, well... And it yeah. takes two. See, that balances itself out. It's yeah. two freaking sorcery points. That's costly. It but, is. Because remember, you can use your sorcery see, points to get back what? spell slots, too. It's one... So it's uh, you, you can use... I think it's... You can gain back on... You gain back... two. It's based yeah, on the level. It's all two the way plus. The it's two plus the level of the spell. So if you wanted to gain back a first level spell slot, you'd spend three, three points. Okay, and I have three total. You have three no. total. Uh, 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 it's it, to get a spell uh, a spell slot back. Fifth. Because you get all your sorcery you points back at what yeah. short rest, I think. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I like I like that one. Okay, so you want quickened? Yeah, I like that. Okay. No, long. Rest. All right. There you go. It is long rest. Yep. It's under font of magic. Font of magic. Uh, Carl, yeah. if you want to read about sorcery points. Yeah, yeah I want to have font of magic. Font of magic. Sorcerer. Font of magic allows you to um allows you to gain back spell slots. So it would cost two points for first level, three points for second, so on and so forth. Okay. All right. So keep that in mind when you're in a pinch, you can use sorcery points to regain spells. Right. I also do that backwards. You, to gain sorcery points? Yes, if you wanted to gain sorcery points, you can spend a slot to gain back that many sorcery points. Okay. Yeah. That's, uh... That's written in here. It is raw? Okay, good. Yeah, so it, it, goes, it goes both ways. It's actually part of the rules. Okay. Okay, good. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to be doing That's some why this. people do the Sorcerer Warlock. Because yeah, the Sorlock. Because they don't can... lose their Ever. built up source points until they finish a long rest right and you can if you don't take a long rest like you say we take a long rest but he says he doesn't want to take a long rest he wants to take eight short rests he can spend his warlock spell slots to gain sorcery points got it okay okay that's what i was telling you the uh, yeah. last week yeah and i've read through all of the sorcerer and warlock, and there's nothing saying that they, you can't use another class's spell yep. slots to do that. No, yeah, yep. So I, that's completely up to you. No, I mean, no, it's I make him like crazy powerful, but yeah, well, just gonna take we'll a cross that bridge rest. when we get there. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I'm still not enough. I'm still a novice enough to where you don't have to worry about me finding all the loopholes. Well, I just got a new book called Malady of a Malady Codex about diseases, and uh, oh Jesus, I can uh, I can fuck with you guys with that too. So. You can be powerful all you want. And see you kill a virus. Then I get AIDS. Yeah. Okay, so, um, there you all go. Right. What are you going to do? Well, I'll sleep them. Okay, so, uh, are you going to use your first ever empowered spell? Sure. All right, so, how many spell points or sorcery points does it take? It takes two, right? Yep, so mark off two. All right, now, how do I do that on here? Empower actions. Under your actions. Okay. 
you'll see uh, it's one sorcerer point. Yeah, for empower spell. That's oh, is it one? So you see where it says empower spell? Yes. Oh, just mark one. Just mark one. Okay. That will automatically reset at a long rest. All right. Okay. So now you get to now that's a second level spell, right? You're, you, yes. Are you casting a set? Okay. So mark off yes. your second level spell. Okay. All right. Now what you're going to do is you're going to roll the dice required, right? What was that for sleep? I think it's it's for second level. Was it like seven d eight or eight? Five d eight first level, second level or higher. It's two d eight for each. Wait, wait. Uh, so it's seven d eight at second 70. level. Now you get to re-roll if you since you spent that. You know, you know what? What I recommend is don't even use the sorcery point yet. So click it off. Okay. You can use your empower spell. Oh no, I'm I'm jumbling on my words. No, you have to actually declare you're empowering it first. Okay. So what yeah, what it says is it. you get to re-roll up to seven times. <laughs> All right. So roll your dice, so and you I'm get to re-roll the right? lowest the lowest seven. I'm roll. Oh fuck. Hold on. But remember, you, yeah, it's DAs. You have to keep what you roll. So keep that in mind. Wait. So I can't roll a seven at a time then? You have to roll all seven at a time. That's how the spell works, yep. And then all the lowest dice. So you see how there's two ones and a three? Okay. You can, you can opt to roll 3d8, okay? Okay. Or up to seven. You can, if you want you can reroll that. I've only rolled six. Nice. Oh, yeah. So reroll. Reroll with 80, 80, or 78. How do you use 7? Uh, pick it up and then right Control click. Control click the dice. What? Pick up the die and then right click. Oh, while no, you're it's holding right it. click, you're right. It'll, yeah, pick up the die you want and there you go. Okay, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. No, I'm good with that. You can just take that. Hey, that's a good roll. Well, yeah. yeah. That's fine. Okay, but you, in that case, this is where it sucks. But you basically wasted your sorcery point, right? That's fine. But how would you know that you rolled so high, right? Yeah, right. there's no way I wouldn't. Yeah, that that's perfect. Okay, <laughs> that is going to sleep. Um, three snakes. Damn, that's it. We have some idea how Damn. powerful they are. They still don't know that we're there, right? No, they just they basically fell asleep. No, there's no uh, way they I would throw know. It again? Yeah. Fuck yeah. Can, uh, can I do the exact same thing? Yeah, and the way the the cool way that sleep works is that it always targets the weakest per things first that are on uh, that are conscious. It's a smart spell. Let's do that again then. All right, go for it. This is my what? Oh, that's eight shit. We'll put one too many. Just uh, drop, uh, drop it off the side of the table. Uh, okay, and I'll try again. You can also drop that that seven d eight onto your hot bar, so you know that it's there as a second level spell. Right, I should do that. Hot. There you go. Now, did you oh, uh, yeah. you empowered the spell? So take yep. those two ones. Two ones. So pick get... up two d eight and re-roll. Can I do the two ones and the yeah. three? And the three. Yeah. Yep. Or the four, or all of them. Yeah, you know what? I'll do one, two, three, four, five. I'll do five five dice? Four. Okay, go ahead. Roll it. So you're keeping the eight and the six, right? The uh, eight, the six. Yeah, eight and the six. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six. Damn it, I did it again. Uh, um, one, two, three, four, five. All right, five. Uh, started today. So that's 14 damage plus your sum now. Oh, shit. Plus 23. That's better. That's 37. You got three more snakes. Which okay, is all of them. so all the snakes are down. Uh, you guys want me to keep throwing? <laughs> Alright guys, what do you guys want to do? I got all the snakes asleep and nobody knows where... Oh, hold on.
could throw the spikes. Now that there's only two of them, we can just attack the focus on our attack on those well, two. What sli sleep? Yeah, Any I did. Attack or damage? Any of them? No, that's why I said go for Don't the other wake two. Up. We that's right, the ladies. Well, spike the head. Yeah. Hey. Is Spike gonna wake up the snakes? I say we'll grapple yes. them. It does damage Don't do if that. they move. No, but oh, it will grapple them. It only them. does damage if they move. But it grapples them. What? It's difficult it's... terrain. It's moving. But... It's moving and writhing. <laughs> yeah, it's moving and writhing. Yep. It would definitely wake them up. Because they're, they're moving through it difficult is... terrain. Nah. Yeah, read it. It says it's writhing okay. tentacle, yeah. writhing, writhing terrain or something like that. It's just camouflaged under under regular terrain, but it's it's definitely moving plants that, that do that. Okay. Or am I I I could be wrong. Am I thinking about entangle? No, I might be thinking of entanglement. I'm sorry. I apologize. Let me. So spike growth is. The no, ground the center of the Yeah. Um, the hay. Range twists and sprouts, hard spikes and thorns. So, yeah, the sleeping snakes would definitely feel that underneath them. Okay. No. There's only one thing to do. The only one thing to do? Go into a rage and charge right in. And All right. Initiative. Yeah, she, uh, she's charging in. She gets, you, uh, you guys get the surprise spot. attack. Okay. Um, before you do that, I am going to let's see here. Oh, yeah. Oh, you are lucky. That's one. Oh. That's not a good thing. Uh, you're immune to fear though, right? As a uh, raged? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yep, okay. Barbarian ancestral protectors. Alright, go ahead and uh... I'm changing the... the um... initiative while we're inside to go with uh, re-rolling it, so you guys can... Combat, where is combat? There it is. I need to be more familiar with my, my options placement. Anyway, just go ahead. You may, uh... Ooh, hey. There you go. Our Aura uh, Pajet came up. Went up to 2d6. Oh, yeah. That's right. If you're an Ardra and you leveled up to 4, your Auto Pajet goes up. You can change that. So you add... It's, um... To do that, like, let's see. You're, a, uh, you're an Ardra, right? Yeah. Wing. Yep. Okay, so go to your um actions uh, tab. I I multi tab. I multi uh, so I don't actually take that, do I? No, auto perche is an archer ability. Nice. Your, remember your magical ability. <laughs> that right, you get. So I go to where? Go to your um your um actions tab. Mm -hmm. See where it says spells more. That's actually not supposed to be that. That's supposed to be racial. Maybe that's one of those things that switched while I was... Yeah, I, I, I fixed it for you. Clean up your thing. Okay, so, now, you see the little uh, uh, magnifying glass next to the damage of auto Perge? Yes. Click that, and drop 1d6 into the dice on, under damage. 
where where it says it. It's already at one d six. Dice one. Yep, but you're adding another adding another d six because you leveled. Plus six. So it actually your 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 nope. Oh. That's a multiplier. Oh. Nope. Just take your take your d six die the oh. actual die and drop it on the where it says die. Oh. There you oh, go. Nice. So now that's how you level up your spells. So all of your cantrips when they level your, uh, have to do this as well. Stuff too. Oh, okay. Yep. So now that base damage has gone up, so every time you that auto perge is now actually pretty useful at yeah, this level. Two d six plus your five damage is decent damage. That's just what. Yeah. Seventeen. So, yeah. A free spell. Yeah. Yeah, it's a free spell. Mm -hmm. Free action. Okay. All right. So that's how you do that. Now. Badass. And it requires no components. So if you're ever disarmed or whatever, there you go. That's yeah. That's definitely my my boot derringer. Yep. It's exactly what that's supposed to be for. <laughs> it's actually still powerful. Like that could be my main weapon. Well, the Divin, the Divins get the uh, get the healing one. Right, I know. Do we have any way you pick that? Or are we all murderers? No, everyone is the same. <laughs> everyone <laughs> likes that. I love being a murderer. Yeah. All right. Uh, all right, Bowie, go ahead. Hit. I ooh. Do I get a second attack? Say again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can now. Remember, with your offhand weapons, I forgot to tell you this. Um, you don't actually get to add your strength bonus to your your damage. So, let me see here. You're not ambidextrous. I know. Uh, yeah, but I forgot about that. I was just reminding myself. Um, but, um, uh, go ahead. Let me see here to make sure. Um, when to... Oh you, oh, you already got it. Which... Missed. Yeah, I missed anyways. Stupid hag. Okay. Um, who's next? Who's going in there using surprise? Who's next in line? You already used your uh, your spells during this surprise round, so. Oh yeah, um, oh, for me for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Val. Val's way in the back. He's not gonna make a build. No, I don't know. They can fear. So. All right. Um, let me drop it on you. Hag one. Damn. Hag two. Oh shit, oops. Huh? Uh, what the fuck did I do that? <laughs> How do Ooh. I drop? She is terrifying. No, I, I got some bad advantages on the hag. Wait, what? My ancestor, ancestral protectors. Oh well, yeah, what does that do again? I, I always forget. I'll remember next time, maybe. Okay. Oh, uh, it's a this advantage <laughs> towards okay. any, any attack roll towards anybody else, and if they attack anybody else. They're a disadvantage. They get a, they get a resist. Right. On that attack. Right. So basically half damage. Oh, I see. Remember, that's for one round. That target. Yeah, okay. So. That target that you hit. So the one that you just hit, right? Yep. Okay. Right. All right. I'm going to look up if there's an effect I can create to do that. Um, maybe not, but we'll see. Okay, I remember that. So that's Hag 1, the C-Hag 1 that you hit. Nope, C-Hag 2. Yeah. You hit C-Hag 2. Whatever. <laughs> Same thing, though. Um, so she is at disadvantage. And the person, whoever she hits, is uh, 
will be if, it'll be if resistant. she attacks me right or... except for mess myself There it is. I grabbed the wrong one. Alright, Brian, you succeeded both. Alright, I'm going to attack Seahag 2. Alright. That Ancestral Spirit is a pretty awesome ability. Hold on. My game just locked up on me. Yeah, mine froze too for a second. No! Initiative yet, have we now? Nope. <laughs> I'm all damn, I'm far down the line. I really like nice. Is that map the is that map feature working for you guys? Where uh -huh. it dude that is awesome. I can't get uh -huh. over it. It's probably because I haven't updated uh fantasy yeah. grounds. Yeah. I don't really need to use two screens now. Okay. No, neither do I. <laughs> Alright, I'm done. Yeah. Done? Okay. Uh, Takashi? Yeah. I'm just in range here. I do have a question, though. What's so up? So if, like, your brony was to use Thorn Whip and pull her, one of the hags closer, like, past me and, uh, Bowie, does that count as an opportunity of attack? If he, if she is grappled, yes, absolutely. Or, or restrained or whatever the whip does, yes. In it. Um, I like to use a long okay. roll, which is able to be Also, I got Sentinel. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Wow, why do I have everything targeted all of a sudden? Back, go ahead. Have <laughs> hey, you seen that too? Mine's doing the same thing. Yeah, that was different. That's cool. I like that. Gia Brony. For some reason, it's making me hard. Weird shit. Really? I'm gonna, I noticed grab, that too. Uh, I'm gonna cast Thorn Whip against Sea Hag too. Okay. It made Jabroni and Mortem target everything. Like, 
Oh. Players and it was crazy. Monsters. Oh, that's. I don't I know, know what the hell thing. will happen. Boredom's still targeting. Uh, 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 so is. So oh yeah, cool. that's weird. It must be the update thing. It must be some sort of bug. I know. Target. <laughs> All right. See how to hit. All right, and it drags it ten feet closer to Jabroni. To Jabroni, okay. So, so it drags Jabroni. it past. J where's right Jabroni past at? Mortem and Bowie. Where did you put Jabroni He's at? He's way stairs. down the stairs. The oh, stairs. from I see. Okay, you're so that's line of sight, and you're pulling um, you're pulling the Sea Hag to there. Right. Alright, opportunity yeah. of attack uh, for both Bowie and Mortem. But right past and we both have Sentinel. Mortem. Yep, so both yeah. of you both of you <laughs> get opportunity of attack on that. See how go ahead. Oh, holy shit. Mortem has the constructs, uh, or the snakes. <laughs> I get, what the, I told you. Yeah, that's weird. But then when I click the targets button, it does, it disappears. Hmm. I can't get rid of the snake. I don't know what the hell. I can get rid of everything but the snake. On my targets for Mortem. All right, hold on. All right. There. there. Okay. Now. Did I hit? Hit. Yeah, you hit. All right, and oh. is now officially initiative. Did Bowie, Bowie do her damage? Did she? Okay. I don't think so. I don't think did so. She? Go ahead, roll Bo do a damage, Bowie. Yeah, she did. I did. Oh, I see. Oh. the wrong. Yeah. Maybe. All right, initiative on um, all of you. I'll update it tomorrow, so maybe it'll get rid of all these glitches for me. Yeah. And then empty your, uh, clear your pillar cache too, just to be on the safe side. Alright, Takashi, you're up! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she was, she's gift wrapped for you. You didn't even have to move, you can just beat the shit out of her. <laughs> These things must not have much of an armor class. <laughs> no, they don't. Their looks are their armor. Oh, right? wait, first off, I forgot. Hold on, Takashi, I have to... Since you're inside of it now, I completely forgot. Wait. Uh, you are right. Bowie did her. You need to take the damage from Sea uh, Hag One and put it on Sea Hag Two. She did her opportunity to attack okay. on the wrong one. The Sea Hag One hasn't been touched. Well, Sea Hag Two is dead. The <laughs> next. All right, go ahead. Uh, oh wait, 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 wait. You did your damage. Oh, he did nine damage to Sea Hag, two, right? Yeah. So oh, you did. You did not. 
do anything. Yeah, so you still get your action. Yeah. But you are frightened. Yes. <laughs> okay. You can still attack and stuff, it's just there's the it imposes penalties. I really can't move anymore, so Okay. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, okay. I was like, I didn't click anything. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna do the same thing. Thorn whip. And See, I want. Okay. Pull it closer. Alright. Don't I get a saving throw to that? No, it's a roll to hit. Got it. And then. Okay. Got it. Alright, so. Well, I'll look again. Um, it, it says if you hit it, if the attack hits, the creature takes 1d6 piercing damage, and if the creature is large or smaller, you pull the creature up to 10 feet closer to you. Okay. Now, you pulled it, but it did not leave the actual threat box of your guys' characters. It didn't invoke an opportunity to attack this time. Well, at least it's mm. better than... Where it was. No one can wake up one snake to lose its attack. <laughs> well, those snakes are going to be asleep for the next, uh, like, minute. Well, yeah. Yeah. Alright, um... <laughs> I get to finally use this. How did Twain get hurt? When did you get hurt? I didn't! Oh, you fucker succeeded! Well, it's, it's you got right. nine damage. I mean, damage. We long rested. <clears throat> I've been sitting in the same fucking spot. I know shit. I don't know why that's on there. Swing is up. Okay. Uh. Whoa, dude! What the hell happened? To... Okay, something going weird. Jabroni's hit points are way too high. He has thirty. <laughs> he has forty-one on my thing. Holy fuck! Now he has forty-one. <laughs> uh, it must be because I keep using my wheel. Um, shit. Okay, what was I, his max hit points? I, I fixed it. Okay, thanks. I got it. Thank you. Mine was at 49 I, I knew earlier. What he was when I Takashi clicked too. him because I did his hit points for him. Takashi right? has... Yeah, I think your hit points might be too high. It is right? Okay. Yeah. Alright, my bad. Yeah, that's right. Can I Alrighty. just blast this guy? What's the range? 120. You sure can. You're lucky you're right outside that fear radius. <laughs> hey, can I also uh, pick up some rocks while I'm at it? Well, Just a couple of stones. Eldritch Blast is a standard action, and picking up stones would be two. Well, it's a... Well, I, I can't... Damn it. All right, next time. Um, all right, uh... Yeah. Well, what are you trying to do? Because if it's creative, I don't Magic know. stone. Magic stone. Oh. Well, those appear in your hands anyways. Oh, they appear in your hand? Yeah, they're magical stones that just... You pick them up, but that's all part of this casting of magic stone. Is yeah, I want to do both of those at this motherfucker from all right. range. Now, ma Wait, isn't magic that's stone a magic stone is a standard action except for throwing the stones as a bonus action? So you uh, have to choose between which spell you want to cast. I'll just do Eldritch Blast. Well, uh, the cat it says the casting time is a bonus action. Is yeah. it? Uh huh. Okay. Uh, See, I'm wrong. 
It says but I'm pretty sure though. it's backwards. Casting is bonus and throwing is a, a... Okay, you're right. Yeah, it would be. So you'd still... It would still... So, okay, still I'm gonna to do an Eldritch Blast, but then I'll do the bonus action of making my rocks. Okay, go ahead and mark right. the spells off. Alright. No, those are both cantrips. There's no Damn! Spell. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Eldritch Blast is son of... So, it's, I just throw a 20, right? Uh, well, look at your spell... Yeah, a I beam did. of crackling energy towards a creature within range. Mm -hmm. a spell attack again. No, it's no, a range spell no. attack. Click the hourglass. The hourglass. Click the the hourglass next to Elder. Uh, the magnifying glass. Oh. Yeah, the magnifying glass. Yeah, yeah. So you can extend it. Oh, Sorry. What, what did I say? Yeah, hourglass. I do that all the time. Oh, I threw it twice. It was a nineteen yeah. and a twenty. So I, I'm going I with the first. That. I'm going with the. With the I'm going with the first one. All right. <laughs> oh. I throw a damage on him then? Yeah, and when you do, right, I'm going to right click on it and have it because it's going to do double damage. Okay. Right click. Uh, don't you right. roll again? Roll, yeah, just, not... Or just, yeah, he's right. Roll roll one more time. Roll again? Yeah, just the, de the hit. It'll cancel out the critical. That's it. Another critical, but... All right. Oh, you don't have anything targeted. That's what happened. Oh, no, you hit. But you hit. So roll damage. No, no. What you could do, bro, Damn is uh, dra drag and drop the first, the first, that 19 plus two, the 21. Oh, okay. Drag and drop that onto the um. The the hat. There you go. There you go. And now roll, damage. uh, roll damage. Yep. Bam. Right. Yes. Yeah. Seven. Damn, dude, you don't get any um. You don't get any like nope. bonus spell damage. You have to uh. No, that's part of the uh, invocations. Got it. You can add, use invocations to empower your elder Got blast it. to pull it closer, pull your target closer to you, repel it, uh, do your spell casting modifier, all kinds of shit. It, it's crazy. So my next turn, then can I use the magic stone as a as an attack as a bonus action now that I've created the thing, or is it a full action now? Uh, throwing a stone would be the full action. Casting it is the bonus. So you can prep it. Yeah. You have the stones yeah. in your hand. So then next next you could throw them. But remember, you're either throwing them and or casting a spell since they're both the same standard action. Gotcha. All right, my turn is over then. I'm gonna okay. stay right there. All right, Bowie is up. Yeah, Mike kind of exploited that. that yeah, he did. Yeah. Morning. Yeah, I, I, that's because that I didn't bitch read the spell blade. fully. Yeah. Oh, it was... More time that what's up. He was ready. Get her. Ah. And now Boo is up. I don't know why I made you go twice. Yeah. Well, just go ahead and end your turn. Alright. Um, Val. Did he really roll a five? Yeah. On initiative? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Val. Yeah, you could have blasted from there, too. <laughs> He, uh, the, the spirit of Baba Yaga glows her eyes and removes the fear curse that is on Kashi. Nice. Alright. Takashi. I don't know why I didn't reroll initiative, but we'll it just keep this going. Yeah. We'll just keep this going. I'm going to change that. Okay.
same thing. There it is. Okay. Yep. Same thing. Go ahead. Jabroni's up. Yeah, I'm looking at a spell real quick. Alright, he's gonna cast Iron Breaker Claws. What does that do? I just linked it so you can look at it. Alright. Alright, so... Pretty much it does 2 to 10, uh, they make a, you choose one creature, which makes a dexterity saving throw. The creature takes 2 to 10 damage on a failure, or half as much on a success. If it fails, it also provokes an opportunity attack from oh, one or two creatures of your choice within 5 feet of it. Nice spell. Yeah, this is... Nice. Damn, that gives so you much free actions. Die this round if yep. it fails. <laughs> All right. Okay. That damn. That's a <laughs> damn good spell. Yeah. Is that level one or two? Yes, it is. I'll I I actually level one. Cats at level two. It's uh extra d10. And it succeeds. Ah, she saved. But yeah, hacks like are known for their spell <laughs> resistance. <laughs> Almost maxed it. <laughs> Good roll, though. Yeah. It should have. It didn't. It didn't half it. Hold on. Dave going on. Oops. <laughs> there. Oh no! Wait. You're gonna die. <laughs> there. There it goes. I got it. Okay. Be dead. Uh, I can cast total this, dead. This would have been a whole lot harder for you guys if those constrictors were alive. <laughs> oh, I can cast toll the dead, right? Oh yeah. Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna cast yeah. that. It's been wounded. Yeah. Yep. So it's extra damage. Spell. It does the D12. Did. Uh, D12. Yeah. Uh, well, if they're it, wounded, yeah. Yeah. One D12. Okay. Hold on. So. Open it up and yeah, open pick it up. the class cast button or move it on to the sea hag. Yeah, there's no save for that. Nope. It's just damage. No, there's a save. Yeah, there's a save. Damn. If it saves, it doesn't take any damage at all. Is it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Now can I throw that thing, the, throw the rocks as a... Was told that a bonus action? No, that's a spell. It's a cantrip. Nope. It should still say action or it's, something. It's a full it. action. It's yeah, a full it's a full action. standard action. Yeah. Yep. All right, never mind then. Luckily, magic still <laughs> wasn't wasted because it's still a yeah, cantrip. It's cantrip. I just figured she's almost dead. I'm like, how is she still? Yeah. I'm not gonna waste a spell. You can also or... throw your auto projet at it. That's oh, twenty six. I, I totally fucking forgot. Yep. See, I have so much. Oh crap! I've been hitting. The... I've been hitting with frostwind blade. That bitch should have been taking D10 damage every time. <laughs> Damn it! I ain't been paying attention. Yeah. Yeah, it's dead. dead. Let's go coup de gras. All the right. And... Yeah, you guys are coup de grawing all the fucking snakes. Yeah, kill, kill them all. Kill, kill them carefully all. Carefully kill the snakes, because I know Bowie, she's going to want to skin them. <laughs> yep. Oh, yeah. 
Yep. Yeah, Dude, there's, a, there's enough snake skin for all of us to have belts, boots, hats. Nice. I know the. I'm still working <laughs> on the uh, that to the. Um... You know Harvester. what I mean. Thank you. All right, I'm going to award experience. We're going to cut it here. You like and those Bowie snakes is seeing? Bowie is skinning snakes. And doing something with the sea hags, surely. Naturally. <laughs> Poking the eye out, maybe that's that could be used in a in a delicious vile liquid, right? Well, now that I got... a hunter. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna nerd out on your. So now that you got Dropbox going, yeah, dev check out some out. of those books. Definitely. Especially. Especially yeah, Tome of the Pact. Yeah, that's, that's where I got pulled up right now. Yep, so go take a couple shits and uh, you'll read it front to back. The, all the books. I have PDF copies of all the non core books. So. I'm looking all... at what you got in here. I mean, there's a ton yep. of shit in here. Yep. And Good I'm bad. always at. Arrival checks. <laughs> Alright, then I'm going to jump off. Here's experience right now. I'm warding. There you oh. go. How far away, man? You guys are far away. <laughs> How many survival checks? Survival <laughs> checks? Eight of them. You know what? For those snakes, I'm just going to give it to you. They're just snakes. The hag will do next game because I got to bring up the um the thing. But remind me next game to put them on the parcel. Hey, experience do we need for the next level it didn't oh, update that for me for level five you need six thousand five hundred yeah six thousand okay i'm stopping recording thank you